All right, we on? We on? I hear it. I hear it. One, two, one, two. Testing one, two. Okay. Sounds good. Sounds good. Sounds like we on? We on? All right. Let's do this damn thing. Ready? All right, let's go. It's the Cuomo sexual. Oh. Big old distraction. They've already tried it on us last year. They're trying it on us again. Let's talk about it. Because my card readings are coming to fruition. And I'm about to reap my harvest. Like it or not, here we come. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Tasty like this tasty beverage. Mm. Woo. About to reap my harvest of these card readings. Yeah, dog. Oh. I've been waiting for y'all to wake up. Like, when are these idiots going to wake up? Well, I did a card reading. Mm, after eh, the beginning of 2021, because I was like, what is going on? I saw this mayhem going on with this election and this orange man bad and all this crazy stuff, right? I said, man, what the hell is going on? Like, where is this? Where's this year going, right? I did a card reading. It's called When the Cat's Away, the Mice Will Play. And then I did a Trump card reading, and then I saw everything. Well, that When the Cat's Away, the Mice Will Play card reading, I didn't show the cards because it, I was just getting tired of doing card readings, and I was getting tired of, because all the energy I was seeing was super negative. And I don't want to say satanic. I want to say it was demonic, and it was. It was super demonic, okay? That's why I like card readings because I can like, tell what's going on. But I didn't want to show the card reading because I was like, oh, man. And I also knew it was going to take time. That's the thing about card readings and all you guys have been pre predictive programming. You do a card reading. That's why I had to do all these card readings in the past because I was like, these idiots are going to be thinking, oh, Mike, it didn't come true. It, dude, it doesn't come true in a day or a week. Okay? It takes time. So that's why I went and bought a GoPro camera and went and did a bunch of videos. And then I, I, I was like, okay, Trump's return. When he comes back, there's going to be information. That's when I'm going to start spreading information or, and, and explaining all my card readings that I've already did six, seven, eight months ago, okay? And start making sense of it all because it's going to come true. It's just going to take six or seven months. You idiots think it's going to happen like the next day. Well, it didn't happen. You said, you said. It's just like, that's why I had to do it. I was like, all right, if I'm going to actually do this i have to do it my way i can't just do card reading and expect like tomorrow it's gonna happen no it takes months just like court cases take months but we'll get into that all right first thing i want to talk about cats away the mice will play all right i did that card reading i'm going to show you what i looked at and i've already showed you one card i've already showed you one card but i'm gonna show you the card that that really i was like oh man and I said, they're going to bleed themselves out slowly. I've done some past uh, videos and stuff. But I'm going to show you why. Because it was this. It was this card right here. I just, bam. All right. And this was the Three of Swords. And you see the swan, the innocence. Basically, you can look at that as the innocence of, of humanity. Everybody just wants to get along, get by, get on. We just want to watch football. We want to watch sports. We just want to get on to get on. But it's Sorry. 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 They just stabbing us in the back. Look at that. Just jabbing us up. Just jabbity, jabbity, wabbity. Isn't it funny? A jab, a jab, a poke. Look at that. Right in the back. And I saw that. They're just going to jab us up. And uh, I saw that. I was like, oh, man. And I also saw that that, that, that means they're going to. This card could mean a couple of different things, too. It can also mean like you're going to have to get over a relationship. You're going to have to do this. But I. I Put it to what's going on. And this is why I always remember my card readings because I go back to them and go like, all right, I remember at the time when I read it what it was, but really what it was is, look at this. We got poked, jabbed, stabbed, all up. And all these cards in my hands are all swords. So this is three of swords. So um, it's coming at us in all types of different ways, all right? And then after that, I've pulled this card and I've showed this card before. And I knew the karma was coming back. Boom, this card right here. This is why I said they're going to bleed slow. You see the blood on the top? And see how the boomerang is kind of coming around and unraveling but raveling? And this is the karma coming back around on these people. And you got to understand one thing. These people that have been doing this and these Georgia Guidestones, they hate my guts. They hate me. They've tried to destroy me and take me down. But I said no. Ooh, look at how the colors are blending with my Archangel Michael, by the way. This is so ironic, right? But anyways... um. Yeah, so they tried to, uh, This it's coming back around. There's nothing, it's coming back around again. Yeah. 
this is for the people, blah, blah, blah. Mm, some rage. But anyways, it's coming back around. There's nothing they can do. The karma's coming back around because of all the stuff they've done, all right? And now they're trying to throw up Cuomo. Was it Andrew Cuomo? Is it Andrew? I don't know. There's like two of these numb nuts. Yes, yeah, Andrew Cuomo, the uh, governor. Oh, oh, we've already seen this. It's the same thing. I keep telling you, it's ritual. Just the same thing. Oh, Cuomo came out. I was like, oh, yeah, I, uh, uh, I'm into butt play. I got the, I got the nipples. I'm into this. That's what I do. I kiss everybody. I tongue down the Jews and the blacks and the and everything. Hey, LGBTQs, come over, little Joey, come over here and tongue your grandpa down. I mean, he just went out there and just went full bore because he's a puppet. And you know, he knows he's a puppet and he is a puppet. So he's just playing. He's been playing his part for the past two years. That's all he's been doing. That's all he's been doing. Same with Biden. And you're starting to see it. And people are starting to wake up like, on? <laughs> and that's why I said I did a video, too. But you guys weren't ready for it. I said the Democrats best weapon they're. It, it, a lot of people couldn't. They didn't understand it. And if it was trolls or whoever it was, I said, Trump was the best weapon for the Democratic Party because it, it combined you guys. You guys could focus on one thing, but when he stepped aside and went away, you were scattered. It scattered the Democratic Party. They did. They were just like, oh my God, we, what do we do? So now they're looking for new, they're looking for new um, things to demonize. They're looking, they're like, Whoa, okay, Ron DeSantis, the, the, this, the COVID, the, the Delta, the this, they, they don't know what to do right now. That's what you're witnessing right now. Right now, literally, we're witnessing that. They have no idea what to do. And so that's going to lead to this. They're going to start stabbing each other in the back because they don't have any, they don't have a lightning rod of Trump. They don't have it. So they're going to start doing this. And it's, it's all a joke right now at this phase. Like, ha, 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 yeah, we're... You know, Cuomo, and they're all kind of, but dude, they ain't sleeping good at night. I'm going to tell you right now, Cuomo is not sleeping good at night, and neither is his brother, uh, Chris, CNN. If you look at him and Don Lemon when they talk, Chris Cuomo looks like he wants to choke Don Lemon out and just, just straight choke him out every time. <sighs> yeah. And then Pasaki, oh my God. I go to look at the White House. What, what's going on? Are we back in the lockdowns? Because they're trying to bring them back around because they brought them back around in other foreign countries. They're trying to bring them back around. But they're kind of like, well, maybe, but but no, but maybe. And you got Pisaki up there just looking like, tr now you can see it, trailer trash, just trailer trash. She's like, um, next question. Oh, my God, I hate this guy. Okay, Peter. Doocy, you know, I'm gonna start calling you Peter Douchey. Okay, <laughs> loser. <laughs> Doocy's like, hey, uh, can you give me some kind of uh facts and evidence to why we need to lock down and be putting these masks back? And by the way, they got the mask, they got the, the excuse me, they got the uh cobre bocas, they got the face diapers on their faces. Why do can you give me any kind of reason? She's just like, oh my god. She's like the girl from Clueless, like chewing on her gum. So do you want to die? Apparently, Peter Douchey over here wants to kill everybody in the world. <laughs> seriously? Like, seriously? Seriously? You want to murder everybody, Douchey? Is that, is that what you want with your life? Is that where you want this, this to go, Douchey? Huh? Face diapers equals nobody dying. In the douchebag right here, Peter Douche. What totally, totally, totally wants you to die. Let's listen to the douchebag. Douchebag, let's listen to you. Okay? You are science. You are the, the medical industry. You are everything, douchebag. By the way, I'm done, and I'm totally bringing on one of my sister. Uh, by the way, BLM, Black Lives Matter, totally. Um, sister girl, so douchey, I would appreciate if you don't ask her any harsh questions, okay? Because she is black, okay? 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 Yeah.
Okay. Anyway, sister girl, you go ahead, take over, do your thing, girl. You do your thing, girl. You know how you, you know how you people do your thing, girl. Do your thing. That's what they do. You take over this podium, girl, and you hand your business in that douchey bag right there, that Peter douchey bag. You watch out for him. I can't sleep at night because of his questions. I got to go. Anyway. That's the clown show that's going on right now. All right. And that's why when I when I did my card read, I said, we're going to have to watch them stab each other in the back and bleed out slow. And I said slow. I didn't say fast. It's going to be a long bleed out slow it's like that dagger that 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 uh that archangel michael has right up here you see he's got a dagger in his hand and you know what cuts more sharper than a dagger sharper than a knife it's the tongue the tongue the words that's why it's the war of the whispers because the tongue can slice you more than a dagger a tongue can slice you more than anything and all these psychics that think they're looking ahead and they go, oh, the archangel comes with the dagger. He's going to come with mystic magic. He's going to come with this and that. He might just come with a slicing tongue. And they couldn't predict that. Because they look to the, their minds are just, what is the worst thing they could do? Because these people's minds are looking at the worst thing, the ten, type 10. And they never thought about it and said, the tongue can cut deeper than a dagger they never thought about that and i did another bunch of card reads on my uh, uh rumble and youtube but let's go to rumble because youtube yeah i'm gonna go with dan bongino is more like screw tube but it's mikey romero all lowercase levels except capital r m-i-k-e-y capital r o-m-e-r-o -E all lowercase no spaces on my rumble but i'm gonna do this because i've done this for obama I've done this for Miley Cyrus, led to her dad. I've done this for Jay-Z and a bunch of people. People that I like, actually. But let's go there. And I'm going to explain this card right here. And this is this one right here. Okay, you see it? You see right here? There's a man who has stolen a sword from the white swan's deck. And he, he thought he got away with it. But he doesn't look at the two... The, the two black ravens or black swans, whatever you want to call them, they're right there. They see it's the universe sees what you want to do. And if you want to take a, a, a little story from the Bible, it's Adam and Eve. Do you think the universe didn't put the apple there? Didn't put it in front of you to eat it? You thought they were just, that was the test. That was the thing. You have free will. You get tested along the way. We all get tested along the way. Hell, I get tested in traffic for 15 minutes and I got to calm myself down, do meditation. But anyway, these people like Obama and everything, they stole something. And they got to understand the universe knows where the bodies are buried. You understand? I'm not saying anybody buried bodies. It's a, it's this way of saying it knows what you've done. And the guilt and everything these people have done is just insurmounting. And that's what we're seeing. And that's what's happening. And the karma is just undeniable. And that's why it will eventually lead, and when I did that card reading, the cat's away, the mice will play, the karma will start to just, they can't do it. They'll start getting paranoid. They're going to start getting paranoid. They're going to start getting crazy. They're going to start stabbing each other in the back. They're going to start bleeding. And they're going to do it to themselves. And I said they're going to bleed themselves out slow. And now my card readings are coming to fruition, you see. And they're tossing up puppets. Biden's a puppet. Cuomo's a puppet. These are the puppets. They're, usually what they do is they just cut their puppets off. They're just... But nah, this is going to go deeper because I want to go into what really is going to happen. I need a drink for this one because I'm getting parched. Forget about this stupid little Cuomo BS. They did this to us like six, seven months ago. Oh, how many? How, it was like 18 people came out. Yeah, dude was coming out. I was like... You got a bung hole, let me lick it. You got a toe, let me suck it. You know, he just came out and was like, I'm a freak. Of fr yeah, yeah, dog. We seen the nipple rings, all right? We we get it. We get we understand, dog. But uh mm. We seen your Roid raging out, uh Roid raging ass brother on uh CNN just looking like he just wants to just break Don Lemon's neck for no reason. Watch out, Don. Watch out, Don. 
Be careful. <laughs> SOS to Don Lemon. <laughs> I know you're an idiot, but I, nobody wants harm, dude. <laughs> you got old Royd Rager over there looking like. <laughs> but anyway, the real deal, Holyfield, is that uh, while they're doing all these distractions, is that's all they are, just distractions, why it's coming back around again. Jazane or Giselle or Jazane Maxwell. I did a card read on this too. It's on my Rumble. Uh, I said Epstein Island. She is the key. It's coming back around. The court case is coming out. The information is coming out. And that's why they're trying to act like they, they got one little hook on like Cuomo. Oh, yeah, he's a pervert. Yeah, of course he's a pervert, dude. Just look at him. He's a freaking Guido, dude. I could... <laughs> Bobby Siles calls him a freaking dehydrated owl. Look at this dude, dude. He's a freaking. He looks like he. <laughs> It looks like he likes to smell, you know what I'm saying? He really likes to smell. Yeah, he likes to. Anyways, but the, the whole real reason is that Gis- Giselle, Gisane, Jelaine Maxwell uh, information is coming out. And I did a, a card read, I already got documented, and it said she was the empress of the island. And she was the most important thing, and I said she is the key. I said Epstein Island, they have the key, and it's her. And all that information is coming out. The only problem is it's it's really, it's, it's in the courts, and it's just, it's coming along slow, but it takes time. That's why everybody over 2020, they were so fast to be like, do you have any proof of this, of false things, of this and that? And it's like, well, it takes time because you have, like, attorneys that you hired to, like, combat it, and this and that. That's why... The courts, it's not its not a nightly show that you watch that it ends in an hour. This thing's going to be drawn out. It's going to be a while. It's going to be like two years, but the, the stuff's coming out, man. So get ready for it because it's coming. Just like everything else I predicted has come true, this is coming true. They're going to bleed themselves out slow. Like I said, bleed themselves out slow. Ain't fast, but you can see it. And now, oh, I can't do this side because of the camera. They're going to start stabbing themselves in the back. That's coming. It's starting. It's little right now. It's little right now. Don't think Nancy Pelosi. She got ideas, too. They're going to stab themselves in the back. When I saw Biden up there, he's like, well, he should resign. But then he had to go, whoa, 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 whoa. But leave it at that for the day because they got to drag this stuff out slow. That's what I've been saying. It ain't going to be, you no know, in one day, two days, three days. No. They got an agenda. It's like, okay, we'll say, you know, he resigns. If he resigns, it's all this whole thing, like work everything out. They just can't throw each other under the bus rapidly. But eventually, I think they will just eventually just just get crazy. Just get crazy. But it's just starting. It's just starting. But like I said, the summer's going to get hot, and now it's getting hot. So let's see what happens. All right. Peace out.